Update 9.22 was released for the common test. We will check how the new matchmaker version works and revise three branches of the Soviet tech tree. The Soviet tank destroyers and medium and heavy tanks will change. Learn more details right now. The common test brought the improved matchmaker. The mechanism for selecting the type of random battles changed. Now the matchmaker tries not to put the player into the same type of battle several times in a row. And now the most important changes. Big and very interesting balance changes in the Soviet tech tree. Let's start with the tank destroyers. The revamped Soviet tank destroyers with rear-mounted cabins released for the Update 9.22 common test. There have been several problems with this branch. For example, the Tier 9 SU-12254 doesn't fit the logic of the vehicle characteristics development and ways to play it. There's also a controversial vehicle at the top of the branch. Some players like it but the Object 263 is rarely met in the battles. To solve these issues, we decided to rebalance the whole branch. According to the plan, this should be a branch of assault tank destroyers, balanced for battles at short and medium ranges. The SU-101M1 and SU-101 will keep their positions. Some of their characteristics will significantly change for the better. Now they're more convenient for fighting in close combat. The SU-12254 will be removed from the game. For now, it's hard to say whether it will return or not. The Object 263 will take its place, the former top of the branch. It's a good vehicle, but not for Tier 10. So we adjusted some of its characteristics, and it fits Tier 9 ideally. The top of the branch will be occupied by the Object 268 version 4. It's a vehicle with excellent front armor and a gun that can cause 650 damage per shot on average. Its gameplay is similar to its predecessors in the branch. In our opinion, this branch is now more interesting and balanced after these changes. At the same time, players have had some doubts and questions about them. We examine them carefully. So we will make the final decision on how the branch of Soviet tank destroyers with rear-mounted turrets will look based on the common test results. Let's move on. The branch of Soviet medium tanks with rear-mounted turrets will also change. Its former top vehicle, the Object 430, will move to a separate branch. This branch will be short but interesting. It will start with the T-44. The Object 430 will become a Tier 9 vehicle and a new vehicle will occupy Tier 10, the Object 430U. These vehicles will play the role of assault medium tanks. Their armor, dynamics, and guns with high damage per shot will help them in doing so. The new tank will take the Object 430's place at Tier 10. It's still being developed and won't appear in Update 9.22. Its gameplay will be similar to the Object 416 and Object 430 version 2. It will have a powerful gun and decent armor. And now let's talk about the most important thing in Update 9.22. We're planning to change the Soviet heavy tanks. We haven't made changes this big for several years. This is the T-10. It's a good vehicle. Players like it. But it's not played the way the IS-3 or IS-7 are. So its place at Tier 9 will be taken by the Object 257. It should fit in with the company of two legendary vehicles more smoothly. The T-10 will remain in the tech tree. It will be researched via the IS-3 and lead to the new Soviet Tier 10 tank. If you have researched the IS-7, your XP will remain on the T-10 and move to the new branch together with the tank. Talking about the new top vehicle, the work on it is still in progress. It won't be released in Update 9.22, but we can already say it will be similar to the T-10, a fast tank with a strong turret. In Update 9.22, we will replace several vehicles at once. You can find out more about the replacements on our website. There are the detailed rules of replacement in the Update 9.22 Preview USSR Tree Revision article. And now, the main piece of news. Three new Soviet heavy tanks will be added in Update 9.22. The ISM, Object 705, and Object 705A. They are powerful and heavily armored tanks. At the same time, they are quite agile. They won't keep up with the IS-7, of course, but will outrun the German vehicles. Their thick armor comes with a gun with higher than average damage per shot. For example, the Object 705A dishes out 650 damage. These tanks are for pushing through enemy defenses at close and medium range. The new vehicles are researched via the IS. 
join the common test, play, and make sure you share your impressions with us. We make this game together.